Okay, here we go on our comedy let's play again. Oh boy, I sure do enjoy doing <coughs> comedy let's play. Stop coughing, oh God. you better not fucking cough. Oh god, I started that off with a joke on a chip. If, if I didn't you even cough have like a even one time during this recording session, I'm gonna be so mad, mister. Possible that run your own reflection. Bitch, I've done it several times already. Yeah. Oh. Of all people, you would know what it's like. Yeah. We got up with Theo from the Eye Temple. Yeah. Hanging out with my comatose boyfriend. He passed out when he went into a Theo, gym. Theo, you're awake. Am I? I'm skeptical. I had a messed up nightmare. Yeah, about that. Wait. Oh yeah, it's all coming back to me now. That actually happened. <laughs> I love how he me. seems kind of unhappy. You carried me. That's hot. Thanks for getting us out. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad we were in it together. I don't know if Red I could have done that alone. You're real strong, aren't ya? Oh my god. There's dialogue options. It's a real Mass Effect. One of them's got steamy Theo, and then one of them's got skeptical Theo. I'm going with steamy Theo. How long was I out for? It must have been a few hours. Man, what a ride on your back. Tell me about it. Are you okay? I mean, aside from the existential crisis? Yeah, I'm fine. There's only one option. It's just skeptical Theo from here on out. Yeah. Clearly this isn't a normal mountain. What's nope. really going on here? I should have told you sooner. Back at the old ruins, a part of me escaped from part a mirror. Part of me. A part I'm not very proud of. It was my undercarriage. I swear I dreamt it. You think the mountain made her real? Yeah. She's been haunting me the whole time. She lashed out at Mr. Oshiro. I think she was the reason the gondolo starled out. And she was there, in the temple. Why didn't you say something? <laughs> I wouldn't have gone in that temple if I knew what this mountain was capable of. I tried to stop you. You could have mentioned that your demon doppelganger was on the loose. Come on, Theo. You know how crazy this sounds. <laughs> I don't even believe myself. Okay, okay. I understand. I'm just gonna... Probably gonna end up fast-forwarding through this. This is dialogue-heavy, unless there's, like, real character yeah. going on here. Uh, it, it's a... It's a character thing. And you're nearly through it. Oh. Now we've got... Shy... Shy Celeste? Or Shy Celeste? Her name's Madeline. Why is Wait, it what so the fuck name did you give her? Seriously, you barely know me. I named her Celeste. Oh. Did you forget that? Oh yeah! I mean, to, to be fair, to be fair, the last time we recorded this was in 2018. Oh my god, I haven't talked to you all year. I think this is my first time talking to you no. all year. We've, we've talked this year. All don't, don't year. Make, don't, please. Wow, please. it feels like a, it, it's been a year since I've seen you. Nick, please. <laughs> please don't do what? this. Don't you love that joke? That I... really funny and original joke? Yeah, what's she like? Dead? Oh, you love her. Actually, you might not get along at first. But you'll eventually love her. She's a literal rock star. She's a musician? That's so cool. Okay, she's not literally a literal rock star. Alex, oh. So he's one of those guys that misuses literally? Is that Theo's deal? Yeah. Yeah. He, he's also from Seattle, so it makes sense. Studying to be a civil rights lawyer. God. Well, family's from Seattle. Wow. How do I remind you of her? Other than my civil rights lawyer degree that I carry around with me <laughs> at all times. You both live so deep inside your own heads, and civil rights. Oh. Alex has this amazing internal compass. It's obvious that she get, she'll get where she needs to be. 
I can see that in you, too. I wish I could say the same for myself. Oh god, they're crossing, they're merging. Yeah. Thank you for believing in me back there. Thank you, Theo. For believing in me back there, I mean. Believing in you was the easy part. I wish I could have helped. I was pretty useless stuck in that thing. Oh no, you made a good projectile. Yeah, you made a great projectile, you held down some buttons. You were at least as useful as Rudo in Ocarina of Time. Probably more so, because you didn't bitch at me. Honestly, I couldn't have made it without your support. Who do you think built that temple? It looks ancient. It must predate everything else here on the mountain. The resort, the ruins, the city. It was made by the ancient Butt-Touch-Aryans. Yeah. Really, it's a class of classic Native American yeah. tribe. Very spiritual people. The boot <laughs> It's a lot of history here. Yeah. This mountain has meant so many things to so many people. I'm starting to understand why that crazy old lady lives here. And he's just like, S -s -s what, what lady? What lady? There is no, there's no lady up here. We're alone here. Now, if you're an ender too, what's her do? I think she's just a mean person. <laughs> but she does seem pretty confident living out here. Content. You said confident. She said content. I said what content, as in what we're producing right now. No, you said confident. Your sister sounds great. I really remind you of her. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You're the one who's dead set on climbing this mountain. And you don't even know why. That's classic Alex. I'm just teasing you. Why are you climbing the mountain anyway? Oh, you're right. I don't even know why. I just had to get out of my head! I'm stuck in a cycle. Piss, sleep, masturbate, piss, sleep. It's a vicious cycle. Yeah. Oh, hey, I'm it, done it, sleeping. It's honestly the cycle of mankind for the past 600 yeah. we years. We wake up, we eat, we shit, we beat, we sleep. Repeat. <laughs> I've had many a soul-destroying day job. Work is fine, actually. I just... Yeah. I'm going crazy. Can't stop thinking about dumb crap that doesn't matter. My brain fixates on these stupid things that happened forever ago. I should be over them. None of it even matters. I'm good at keeping up appearances, but the truth is I'm barely holding it together. I'm sorry, that's pretty rough stuff. Can I help? You're already helping. Feels good to say it out loud. You don't talk to anyone about it? No, not really. My mom knows I get depressed and have panic attacks. That's about it. No wonder you feel trapped. How do you cope with anything? <laughs> I drink, mostly. Hey! <laughs> There's hey! the best girl! <laughs> this? You, you said Pee-wee's magic word of the day! Drink! Wait, should I get the actual rum to celebrate the goodest mm. girl? If you don't have it by your to the side of your desk, I mean it's right under my desk. Ah, oh, you can reach it down again. I the moment's over. I get mad at people on the internet. <laughs> hey, in the comments down below, leave a comment. Say play hat in time, but for real this time. We're sorry the footage was turned into garbage. Blame Nicholas. Um, what? It... <laughs> okay, it was only tangentially his fault. I don't- I don't blame okay. him. I did a test recording! But anyway, leave an angry comment down below. And while you're at it, make sure to SMASH that like button. Or and click the bell as well. It. Click the notification bell if you don't know. That'll let you get notifications for a thing. Hey Theo, what brought you to the mouth? Oh god. I've had a few moments looking back and balancing my own audio where I'm just like, Jesus Christ, Corwin. Like, that's gonna be the worst yet. Yeah. That came from my soul. <laughs> what brought you to the mountain? 
<laughs> I'm just kind of bumming around, as usual. I started this new job in Seattle. Yay! Play the fanfare. Come on down to Seattle now. We finally have a hockey team. Our whole Wait, city is depressed had... and jobless, and we're gonna lose in the hockey games. Wait, I thought we already had a hockey team. No. The Seattle Thunder or something Th like that? The Thunderbirds? That's an amateur hockey team. I've seen hockey games in Washington. Or maybe this is Canada. a great line of conversation, but we should stop having it. Okay. <laughs> I thought I finally knew what I was supposed to be doing with my life. But I hated but it. I hated it. So I quit after a week and hopped the bus to Canada. Yay! Play the, the Canada fanfare. Help me. Confucius Corp, put up pictures of expensive Canadian food. End the episode there. <laughs> I just felt this urge to get lost in the middle of nowhere. Now that I'm saying it out loud, I realize how flaky it sounds. It just sounds like you're under a lot of pressure. Not really. Everyone is so patient with me. Though I guess I am putting a lot of pressure on myself. People always think I'm comparing myself to Alex. But I swear, that isn't the problem. Swearsies. Swearsies, I'm just worried that I'll never figure out where I'm going. You said you wanted to feel lost. Maybe you should just embrace that for now. Maybe. The second one will just end the thing. Yeah, but, uh... I guess I better just go through all the dialogue stuff, even though this is generally a question I don't like asking people. Yeah. I, I don't know. I don't, <laughs> do we want to oh, do... are you gonna hurt Madeline's feelings? I I wouldn't figure they'd give you the option to just be a wretched dick to Madeline. <laughs> I don't know. I just I I consider I'm gonna I'm gonna take a moment to personally just say that I consider this to be a question that I do not ask people. Like if people if people want to talk about their depression and all that that's fine. But like. I don't really, like, put people on the spot about it, is sort of yeah. my policy. Yeah, yeah we'll no, I it. understand Because it's the that. video game. Do you mind talking about what depression is like? Very clinical. It sucks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but what does it feel like? Feel like! Alex struggles with it too. I really want to understand. We can talk about something else if you want. It's like, I'm at the bottom of the ocean. I can't see anything in any direction. It's claustrophobic, yet I feel exposed. I remember feeling normal, but now it just feels, it feels just out of reach, no matter what I try. Then again, I was probably always messed up. It just took something hurtful to bring it out. There must be something wrong with me. Whatever happened, I'm sure it's not your fault. <laughs> well, hold on there, Theo. <laughs> hold How on many there. Cat? How many cats did you murder, Madeline? <laughs> <laughs> I just... I love twisting their furry little necks. <laughs> the little... Meow! <laughs> so... <laughs> thrilling. Meow! <laughs> I don't know. I'm just floating in this abyss, swimming in a random direction. Hoping that I find something. That's really why I'm here. But I can't escape myself. I'm literally fighting myself the entire way. Maybe this is all pointless. Celeste, you just saved my life. That's not pointless. Yeah. Look, you're a good person. You're a little intense, but you're a good person. I think you're just trying to push out of that rut. I think you're just trying to push out of that rut you're stuck in. And that's a totally legit release. I'm having trouble with my words now. <laughs> Apparently 14 yeah. minutes was where it would like you can't keep yeah. going. It, it's that's just... a totally legit reason to climb the mountain. Maybe. That's helpful. This I like to... <laughs> that's haunting you. 
Maybe she comes with the territory. So you think I'm stuck with her forever? Well, she's stuck with you, too. That's not helpful. <laughs> Why not take a vacation oh. instead? This is a vacation. <laughs> Why not take a vacation instead? What do you mean? Dude, you needed a change, so you chose to climb a mountain. Why not do something relaxing instead? Go to Hawaii, or like, take a bath. <laughs> you know, Make a vacation the lizard spit. The Flick the bean. I guess I feel oh, like God. I need to accomplish something. Sounds like you have enough on your plate already. I guess it is kind of extreme, but that's how I am. Girl, have you ever heard of anal beads? <laughs> I need something to challenge me. Anal beads. And I can't just do something a little bit. Anal beads. It's all of me or no, she, it's, uh, she just keeps giving me anal beads. Yeah. So you want to destroy this part of you? Won't that hurt you too? If I don't, she's just gonna keep bullying me. She says she's protecting me, but that's obviously not true. I, I think she could deal with getting bullied a little bit, you know? Maybe she I thinks think, she uh... is. She could be some kind of twisted defense mechanism. Honestly, who cares? She has so much control over me. I hate it. Maybe you can learn to control her instead. I'm having trouble doing the Theo voice because I ate a yeah. large, very sweaty pizza <clears throat> a while ago. The feather helps a lot. Thanks for teaching me that. Just one of my grandpa's many nuggets of wisdom. Like, don't trust the white man! The Jews, Theo! They control everything! Theo, did I ever tell you about the bankers? Coincidentally, the bankers are Jewish! Are you close to your grandpa? Yeah, I was. Oh, I'm sorry. It's then okay. he moved to Vegas, and now he's is. just banging strippers and yeah. doing cocaine. All I can do is stay positive and live a meaningful life because that's what he would want. I'm so sorry, Theo. Thanks. What else did you learn from your grandpa? You know, this has so gone a lot stuff. longer than I thought it would. Actually, he was the one who told me about Celeste Mountain. He always said this place changed his life. After I quit my job in Seattle, I realized how close I was to him. I felt like he was telling me to come here. Grandpa said that the mountain was special. Do you think he went through the temple like us? Do you think he understood the power of the mountain? Bitch, no! You never talked about <laughs> what happened here. I doubt your grandpa was as messed up as me. His experience was probably less... Violent. Violent. He found the mountain before I was born. I don't know what he was like before that. I wonder what he learned about himself here. You know what? I want to remember this night. Let's take a selfie! I thought you'd never ask. Aww. Aww. She's gained her confidence. This is a nice game. If you go to Instagram.com forward slash Theo under stars. Theo under the star. Theo. Theo something. You, you can see minute? all of these selfies. And, and more. more. And more. Just come on down to Theo Understars at Instagram.com. You can see selfies. You can see sex tape. But just nope. a little bit. No. Nope. nope. You can also see the epilogue of the game there. So, yes. Spoilers. So I'm uh, sorry. Don't go there until you finish it. Or you watch us finish it. Because you're along for the ride at this point. You're like, yeah, well, I, I ain't got nothing to do today. I'll watch two fucking idiots play a video game. 
You know, despite everything, I feel pretty good right now. Wait a second. You're gonna reach the summit tomorrow. Don't jinx it. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm ready to put this all behind me. I'll be cheering you on. We should get some sleep. Okay. Good night, Theo. Thanks for being cool. What can I say? It comes naturally. Then she wakes up a few hours later because she just hears... <laughs> what? It's so pretty. Aurora Borealis! At this time it's of pronounced. night, in this it's part pronounced. of the world, localized entirely on this mountain. <laughs> yes, sir. Steamed hams are nearly ready. Uh. Go up. Go up. Go oh. up. New, me new mechanic alert. New mechanic alert. So to break the bubble, you have to dash into it. Understood, Crappin. Understood, Crappin Falcon. Do We're going Captain to Falcon space! Is, do you think Captain Falcon is the Smash character with the least to do with his actual games? I mean, it's it's certainly a contest. He's also the Smash character that was hardest nerfed from fucking Smash 4, I feel. I don't know. Well, the difference between Brawl and Smash 5 Meta Knight is fucking hilarious, honestly. Yeah. The Northern like, Lights are so beautiful. Yeah, they are. Where are we? We need to talk. Okay. I love how sad and scared Battleline sounds. Yeah. I finally understand who you are. You're not my true reflection. I'm not. You're everything I need to leave behind. You're cruel, paranoid, controlling. Why would you say that? <laughs> You're just no, being hurtful, okay. man. I understand now. You're a bitch! I don't need you anymore! You're a controlling whore! Bethany! Free me from this pan-Islamic caliphate! Let me see my kids, you fucking whore! So you're just abandoning me? I'm setting you free. We'll both be so much happier. You're so... So... So stupid! <laughs> you think you can just leave me behind? <laughs> Bitch, I'm outside the text box! You think you can blame everything on me? You think you're above me? Oh... <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Calm down, please. <laughs> Calm down! Breathe, Celeste. Use the feather. Oh god, not again. This mechanic sucks. You're just bad, you know? Yes. I'm bad because it's very, very imprecise. <laughs> Don't worry, I had a lot of trouble with it, too. Oh, it's, it's so oh. fucking... I'm... Do you see how... Oh, or is this a supposed to fail one? <laughs> oh. You're gonna think about a feather to stop me! Oh shit, she cut the feather. You are not above me. And you can't climb this mountain. It's time to accept that. Okay, get back in your fucking text box. Please, it's calm, scaring me. Back to the text box, please. Yo, titties. Bitch. Celeste, what's happening? Well... You nearly died there. <laughs> <laughs> Down to tentacle hell. Tentacle hell is a zone I'm all too familiar with. Oh, zone ton. It's not. You know, that's not even what I meant, but... Okay. 